Margaret of Pearl here and welcome to my priestess path. If you're joining me today and this is your first time joining me, I am a priestess of light. I am bringing you a message from this beautiful sacred tree. It's my favorite tree. Uh, when I went on my morning walk, I was actually drawn to place my third eye on the trunk. And when I did, I felt and saw the roots of Mother Earth bring in energy and life force into my body from my earth star chakra all the way up to my root and i saw a toroidal field uh, electrical circuit and i heard let let gaia give you some energy i'm kind of uh, uh running a little bit of a fever today but as i connected also I heard loud and clear and it's so beautiful of a message and it was the source of all creation is within you the source of all creation lies within all living things and it just reminded me that we are all connected through one cosmic mind the source of all creation is divine there's divine timing there are timelines that we can consciously jump into jump on and live from that frequency but i have been drawn to share with you a little bit of a story about this beautiful tree uh in the beginning of my channeling sharing my channelings with the world and channeling with the ocean codes and mother gaia i used to come over to this beautiful tree uh, since then there's been a lot of vandalism and a lot of crime in this area so i stopped visiting for a few months uh, every time i wanted to come to this area my intuition told me no it's not a good time and i just trust that intuition so this morning when I felt it in my heart, I called to come over here and I did and I'm so happy that I did because I can feel so much love coming from the wisdom of this tree and I wanted to share with you an activation through light language. If you would like to consent to this light language of a tree of life activation with me today, you may like, share, subscribe. I do so through light language as well as weaving through my hands. So I will be <laughs> connecting with the wisdom of this tree. Channeling only the highest purest light, free of life transmission begins. Daro ko yung mina ale hausi sa le mina ale ko tis le mina katerya ko tus kuku ni mina ya ta ta ya tus kya le le kati mina ko tus kuter mina katalya ka tus ya le le ko tus ni le katerya mina ko tus ya tus mina kati kare kira karo ni mina ali tus kuti mina kater aru kuti mina ta ya ta ko seria ni mina ka tus kuti mina katerya ko ya mina ya tus seria tus mina aru tus ay ata le le ka tus kuti mina kater ali tus kuto ni mina kati kare kisha ni mina ali tus kuto ni mina ya ta le le ko tus kuti mina ウディアルスカルコチュニスクリクトゥマナウディアルメアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアアア
all of our timelines are intertwined that his son mother showing me these branches once you realize and understand this concept of the tree of life you will understand that your inner world reflects sorry i misinterpreted that your outer world reflects your inner world Mother Earth is going through her own ascension at this time. Connect with her. To help metabolize these solar flares that have been coming in, raising our frequency. For we, in this the body of this dimension that we house the elements of the earth the sun the moon the stars the water the fire through our breath we bring things into life I'm seeing a dragon from the core of the earth coming up to join us Call upon the protectors of the earth. Be of the protectors of the earth. They're showing me ley lines on the earth grid. In order to connect to the grid of the earth, all you need is to use your intention. We, nature, will respond to you. Through the birds, the breeze, through the trees, feel the embrace of Manakata's consciousness of Mother Gaia. call upon the guardians of the earth to ask them what you can do to assist that it is as simple as observing acknowledging and loving yeah Grounding now to the roots of the earth, grounding us back to the roots. I love you so, I love you so, I love you so. Rooting down now. Manukadea de Gashi Gala Kotosku rooting down now. Kahoshikitskriya rooting down now. Kushikitia rooting down now. Kushikinikate rooting down now. Kushikotoskur Kodi Mene Kiata Koska anchored down.
I see a ball of light, which is our earth star connecting us to the center, to the core of the earth. For those that are joining us at this time, we thank you and we honor you for joining. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you for joining to receive the Tree of Life activation. The dragon that I saw was a golden dragon guardian. And I just feel immense love right now. And I felt when I heard feel the embrace of Mother Gaia, a breeze came and I just feel so warm inside and I feel it radiating out of my heart space and my back. <clears throat> so we ask now to disengage and disconnect our energies. Gotta go shake my hand. And if you're still with me here, I'm just gonna give you a short tour around this beautiful, beautiful, beautiful bean. <laughs> um, yeah, so I really haven't been visiting this wisdom tree because there's been a lot of things happening over here and one of those things was I started uh, doing my prayers in the branches of the trees and shortly after um, I would find trash a ton of trash um, I was doing like trash pickup with one of my friends for a while and like blades and tampons and toilet paper like not your usual average like not a plastic cup like the most the grossest things that you can leave in there uh, another time I was here there was actually a bunch of branches here like coconut husk and I saw smoke coming out of the tree and it was on fire and so I called uh, 911. There are people in this neighborhood who saw but didn't call 911. I'm not sure why this, why you would just let this happen in your neighborhood. Um, that's kind of what we're facing in this world today. Uh, another time I came here, all this graffiti is new. So all this graffiti is new. Yeah. Uh, well, it's not new now. It was. It just wasn't here before. Um, and then recently, today, I found all these branches in here. I'm not sure who placed them here. I don't know what the meaning of this is. Uh, but yeah, there are just a lot of things that happen in our neighborhood. And just a friendly reminder, you know, I mean, even if like places aren't <clears throat> like there's a bunch of branches here. I don't, I don't really know um, even and there's blades um, even if Places that Are known to be Dangerous, but obviously don't put yourself in danger But if we allow for forces or people or entities to behave in this way and treat mother earth this way Pretty soon. We'll just all be hiding in our rooms. We'll be all hiding in little cubicles and boxes when we should really be connecting to nature and this is just kind of the things that we're dealing with now right and if you're a light warrior a light worker a priestess a shaman just overall a good person who loves who loves this world and understands that we're here and we can create heaven on earth then i encourage you to do your part even if you're just greeting a flower, okay? <laughs> Even if you're just hugging a tree, because since we're all connected, our consciousness is all connected. Hey, look, I hope you felt the frequency of this tree, okay? And anyways, they're doing some kind of stuff across the street, so I should head back now and just wanted to let you know that I'm here and I am so happy that the dragons came in. That was really cool. <laughs> 
And if you guys have any questions about grid work or connecting to the earth, feel free to ask me. I'd love to know also your experience with this transmission of channeling and just wanna say thank you. So thank you, thank you, thank you. I love you, I love you, I love you. And I will see you on your highest timeline.